The computer turned on, the fans are humming, the lights are on, but there is no image on the monitor. What to do? Let's look at various possible options, and after checking them all, you will probably find a solution to your problem. Please note, if your situation is slightly different, there is no image, and the computer doesn't turn on at all, no sounds, then watch another video, this one. And if it beeps, transmitting some error code, then this one. In this issue you will see what to do when the computer shows signs of life, noise or light, but doesn't beep and you have a black screen with no image, not even technical information uh, and the manufacturer log appear. What does this essentially mean? That the image from the computer doesn't reach your screen. Therefore the problem is hidden somewhere along this path. To find it, let's think about what path the image takes. You can see it now in the diagram. The image is formed in the video card and transmitted to the monitor via a cable, but the operation of the video card is closely connected with the processor and RAM. This connection is provided by the motherboard and the power supply unit supplies all these devices with power. All these elements can be the cause of the problem of no image on the monitor when the computer is on. Let's start checking from simple to complex. And first, check the cables and connections. You don't need to disassemble anything for this. Just make sure that the cable is tightly inserted into the monitor on one side and into the video card connector on the other side. And the cable itself is not damaged or pinched anywhere, it has not been beaten by rats or a cat. Try to pull it out and insert it again. It happens that connections become loose or oxidized over time. And if it is a laptop, then it is worth checking the condition of the cable that goes from the board to the screen. It is also worth trying to connect the monitor through a different cable to rule out a connection problem. The second, check the monitor. Does it turn on for sure and does it have power? If there is a power indicator, is it on? Maybe there is something with it power cable. If possible, try connecting the monitor to another computer or laptop. This way you will know for sure whether the problem is in it or not. Or vice versa, if there is another monitor, or for example a TV, then connect the computer to it to check. The next step is to check the video card. If you have an external video card, try moving the cable to the motherboard connector using the integrated graphics, if any of course. Also check if the video card fits tightly in the PCI slot. And if the video card has additional power, 6-pin or 8-pin, check if it is connected well. Does the video card fun work at startup and is there a burnt smell? If you will find some of it, maybe it was damaged. The fourth, RAM or operating memory. As we said, it also participates in the formation of the image and in the computer startup. Moreover, without it, the BIOS, the motherboard firmware, simply will not start. How to check it? If you have several RAM modules, try to remove them all, then insert only one and turn on the computer. Then insert another one instead and try to start the system with another module. There is an advice to clean the contacts from oxidation with a regular eraser, but this is rarely necessary. If the problem is not solved again, move on. In this video we are talking about a problem that is associated with hardware problems. But if you want your Windows system to fly, I have developed a program that helps with this. It not only cleans uh, the computer from cache and frees up disk memory, but also helps get rid of unnecessary programs and services that steal your resources. The PC No Problems program can even disable the built-in Windows antivirus. It will be especially useful for those who have a simple and not powerful computer, as well as for those who lack like cleanliness and order in the operating system. All information and the program's website are in description. Fifth, Reset BIOS. BIOS contains information about input and output devices, and if it fails, the computer will turn on hum but not work. Try resetting the BIOS. To do this, you need to deprive it of power, and it is powered by a round battery that is on the motherboard. Turn off the PC, take off the power cable, take the battery out for 5-10 minutes, press the power button and hold it for 10 seconds to reset the residual charge, and then put the battery back in. If after this everything worked, then I advise you to update the BIOS version. Usually manufacturers have a special driver program for this on the official website. If this happens again, you either need to reflash the BIOS or there is a problem with the motherboard. The sixth, check the power supply. The problem with the video card not displaying an image may be insufficient power of the power supply. Either it is too weak 
or it is broken. When you disconnect the external video card and use the built-in one, the problem may disappear. You can determine that its root is in the power supply if you try to start the computer with another power supply of sufficient power. And the last, processor and motherboard. These are the most complex elements, but if none of the above helped, perhaps the problem is with them. For an accurate diagnosis, you will need to test the components separately. For example, the processor on another board, the same RAM and video card should be rechecked on another computer. And if you were unable to determine the problem after going through all these points, then your only thing left to do is to take the computer to a service center. But I hope you did it. Be sure to write a comment later what was your problem and if you have already encountered such a situation in the past, then share what helped you then. Subscribe to the PC No Problems channel, it contains very useful information for those who have a computer. See you in the comments!